Hello, this is your girl Fossology, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Make sure you like and subscribe. Make sure you click that notification button so you'll know exactly when I'm uploading new content. Today I am in GIMP and I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to get rid of a background that you just don't want. Now I found this cute photo, but I wanted the logo to go on maybe a shirt or some shorts. You know, something cute. Um, but I don't like that the TM is there. As you guys can see, the TM is right here. And I don't like the white in the background. So I want to get rid of that. So let's, let's, let's try to do a quick tutorial on how to do that. Okay, so I clicked on the brush, the spray paint tool. Or you could do the paint brush. It's, it's not, it's actually really not going to matter. Um, and I wanted to make sure that I clicked on, you know, the, the foreign color and make sure it's white because I want to get rid of this TM sign and I have to spray paint that out. So I'm going to remove that. Now that's not the white that I like. So I'm going to pick the actual white, white. Let's see. You adjust it and press okay. And then you're gonna see that it blends in there. And if you want to look closer, you adjust. So I'm about to adjust it right now to a hundred, so we can see exactly what it is that I'm erasing. See, I'm erasing this part. It's horrible. Um, it's easier to erase it with the paintbrush, but I didn't feel like doing that, but I'm just going to do that. So I pretty much erased it. Now I'm going to scale it back to, I think it was 33%. Yeah. So this is what it looks like. So I no longer have the TM sign, so that's a good thing. Now I'm going to click on filters. A filter. Actually, I go to tool selection tool and I'm going to go to fuzzy select. I'm going to have that on and then I'm just going to click the background there. Now I can adjust it to where I want. And I'm going to click down transparency, add alpha channel, always do that. And then colors, color to alpha. And you're just going to move that over all the way. Now you see what I did. Now I want to get rid of this white part here, white part here, here and here. So let's do that tool selection tool fuzzy select and I click that and repeat you see how simple that is I click this filters repeat I do the same with this filters there you go repeat I'm going to do the same filters repeat. So it's pretty much simple. This is, a, this is super quick. So I just got rid of the background and I love how it looks. I love how it looks. This is, this is beautiful. Look at the color. This logo is going to be on one of the shirts that I'm going to be doing in VU later. Um, and I'm going to show you guys exactly what that is. But this is the logo I will be using. And make sure you save it as a PNG if it's not already saved as a PNG. And you want to overwrite. Always overwrite. And it's saved. So when the next time you log out of it and then log back in, you will see the background is gone. And I will use this logo on a shirt that I will be doing. So make sure you guys like the video. Make sure you subscribe, and if you have any questions or concerns, please leave a comment down below, and I'll get back to you ASAP. Thank you, and have a good day.